up? Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back. Head to Starbucks. I was gonna try and mobile order the orders because I didn't want to be annoying because a lot of them are just like customized orders, but I think I'm gonna have to go in because I can't really get a lot of the customizations on the app. So let's head to Starbucks. Let's go to Starbucks. I'm so looking forward to this. Is we have acquired the goods. I only got four and I got them all iced because it's still kind of warm here, but let's go home and try these out. I am I'm so excited. <laughs> What is up? Welcome back to my channel. I am so excited about today's video. It is definitely out of my comfort zone, but you guys know me by now. I just have given myself the title of coffee connoisseur and the queen of the fall. So there was no better way to spend my Tuesday afternoon than trying fall coffee. Yay! Four drinks to try for you guys. I posted on Instagram asking what your fall Starbucks order was. Um, so if you guys aren't following me on there, I will put my Instagram up on the screen here so you guys can follow me because I just, it's where I get all the info from you guys. It's where I ask questions for Q and A's. It's where I ask questions for videos like this. So make sure you guys are following me on there. And before we get into the video, stop and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up because it helps so much with the algorithm. And leave a comment down below after the video letting me know what your favorite drink was. So, like I said, I asked you guys on Instagram to give me some drink suggestions and I'm laughing because Literally 70% of the people that sent me drink suggestions said, this is probably gonna be too sweet for you, LOL. And if you know me, you know. I like most of my drinks with like one pump at most as a treat, usually I drink my cold brew black. So this is all treat, treats for me, but I'm very excited. I will chai, got some espresso, got some iced coffee. I did get everything in ice form because everything just tastes better in ice form in my opinion. But you can pretty much get all of these hot, and I also substituted all of these for either um, oat milk or almond milk because I can't do dairy. So I'm just gonna pick one. I'm gonna get a straw. First one, I'm just gonna grab one. This is, ooh, okay, I'm excited about this one. Got, I think I got everything half sweet as well because like I said, I don't like stuff super sweet. But this is a tall vanilla sweet cream cold brew, my favorite treat drink with a pump of pumpkin in it. I definitely think I'm gonna like this because I just love a vanilla sweet cream cold brew. It's like my favorite treat drink and I love pumpkin, so. Let's give her a good shake. Give her a taste. Wow, that is sweet. Okay, we're starting off with a bang. I give this a solid nine on 10. So, so good. I think it's because I feel like vanilla and pumpkin go so well together. This is so good. Wow, okay, this is definitely like a treat drink for me. It's definitely like a treat drink for me, like my Friday drink or like a road trip drink, something just like on the sweeter side. But super, super good. Um, you know, if you don't want to die of diabetes, you might want to get it half sweet. Kudos to you if you can drink this fully sweet. Um, it's just a lot. But yeah, highly recommend it. Like I said, a tall half sweet vanilla cream cold brew with a pump of pumpkin. Nine on ten pumpkins. Next one. Actually, this is a grande. What is this? Okay, this one I got a lot, actually. I got this one the most. I wanted to pick something that I got the most recommendations of because I knew it would be good. And this is a grande blonde double shot on ice with one pump of cinnamon dolce and almond milk. So this is like the only non-pumpkin drink that I got, but it's still fall. I feel like cinnamon is still fall, you know. This, we're gonna give it a stir because I think all the espresso like went to the bottom. Also, so this one has a new nitro lid, which we love. I'm excited about this because I love stuff that tastes like coffee. And this to me will probably taste like an Americano, which is like my go-to order. Oh, that is so good. Wow. I give this a nine and a half pumpkins on 10, honestly. If you don't like your coffee to taste like coffee, you won't like this. You definitely just stick with like a vanilla sweet cream cold with pumpkin or something. This is for the people like me who just like a little hint of sweetness in their coffee. This is the perfect drink. This would also be so good with a pump of pumpkin, I think. Wow, this is so yummy. Whoever recommended this to me, I owe you a Starbucks gift card because this is amazing. Gr Once again, grande blonde, double shot on ice with almond milk and a pump of cinnamon dolce. Mm. I think you could also combine this and be like a pump of pumpkin and a pump of cinnamon. That would also be good. Wow, amazing. Okay, let's switch up with chai. I have actually never had chai in my life or maybe once i'm not a chai gal at all but i'm really excited about this this is a tall this is a complicated order y'all do you see how long this is that is a complicated order a tall iced chai tea latte half sweet with almond milk 
add pumpkin cream cold foam with a single shot of espresso oh she also put she also put add shot in cold foam which is not you're not supposed to do that but i'm sure it'll taste good lot two in i don't know if you guys follow any like disney instagrammers which you probably don't but sunny the sunny sg which i'll leave her instagram down below she has really cute disney content this is her like go-to known for order which is a chai iced chai with pumpkin foam so i'm excited to see how it goes together It's not bad. I think if you liked chai, you would like this. But once again, I don't really like chai. I like my coffee to taste like coffee. Like, to me, this is not it. But I know there's a shot of espresso in it, which makes it a bit better. If it didn't have the espresso, I'd, I'd probably not like it at all. But I definitely don't mind it because it has espresso in it. But to me, this is just like a waste of sugar. Yeah, I'm not really digging this. I give this, like, maybe a... 4 on 10. 4 on 10 pumpkins. And no hate against you if you recommended this. I just don't like pumpkin. I just don't like chai. I don't know. But it's a very good fall drink if you're not into like coffee. You'd probably like this. Okay. And our last drink I'm so excited about. And this is a Disney drink. Well, it was invented at Disney World. I actually ordered as an iced latte. But someone told me to try it as an iced coffee because they knew it didn't like stuff super sweet. So this is just the Cinderella latte but in a nice coffee form. Which is basically just a latte with half the pumps white mocha. Half the pumps of pumpkin. So I did one pump of each. A few Disney people recommended this to me. But told me to get it in the cold brew or coffee form because they know I like coffee. I'm just not a latte person. Like I don't know why you need to have that much milk in a coffee, you know. But let's give her a go. Really gonna like this one. Mainly because it's Disney. Oh! This is so good, you guys. I'm not sure if this is like maybe like a fall Christmas coffee baby because it has white mocha and white mocha makes me think of Christmas. This is amazing. Oh, you guys need to try this one. Wow. It's like the white mocha and the pumpkin kind of like cancel each other out and they just make like a subtle fall white chocolate taste in your mouth. This is amazing. This is 10 on 10 pumpkins for me. This is amazing. Can you guys tell that my dog is on the chair right now? This one was my absolute favorite. Oh my God. I'm gonna drink this whole rest of the day now. I think I would next time get it in like a grande form so it would be a little less sweet because it's amazing. Wow, this is definitely gonna be my coffee I'm gonna have for the rest of the day. Wow, I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little extra video. Anyways, let me know down below which one you guys think in your opinion would be the yummiest. Let me know if you guys try any of these and tag me on Instagram. I love being tagged in your Instagram stories. And if I forgot to try your fall Starbucks order or anywhere order, let me know down below because I would totally be down to do around two of these. This was so much fun. So like I said, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're not already. Let me know down below what drink I should try next. And I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.